I know people have gotten relationships because they see each other out in the bars and they think that, oh yeah, she's hot, like, cool, like, we hooked up last night, oh, like, wow, high five, bro, like, cool. Um, are you gonna see her again? No, like, maybe, I don't know. Not only that, you know, when you're in love, it could be like, that could be your everything and it could be the worst thing for you too. Everybody has a shorter attention span these days and it's, it's flavor of the week. You like something this week and it's, okay, I'm over this, let's move on to the next one. If any of my ex-girlfriends see this, I've, they've been great girlfriends in the, uh, in the process. But this is like all sped up now, like with the online dating and uh, Tinder. <laughs> I think women get very fixated on it because um, as a society we're so focused on trying to find a partner, find somebody you can spend your life with, um, or just find somebody you can have fun with. So it's a, it's a common goal that everybody shares, so I think women do tend um, to fixate it on a lot. The worst relationship I've been in is where I dated a guy that was addicted to drugs, and I loved him, but he had a drug habit so he couldn't love me back. People like bad things. So yeah, if. I mean, if you like develop feelings for someone and you just kind of put up with, you know, their, their crap and then you like come to love that person, then yeah, it's definitely like when you can't have it anymore, you're like addicted to it and you need that from someone. So. I have a tattoo. Um, these are her uh, lips actually. If you can, you want to zoom in on that. Yeah, it can make you do such crazy things. like. Um, yeah, people getting their um, girlfriend, boyfriend's name on their body, you know, or running off after a couple weeks to Vegas to get married. That's a tough question. I know, right? What's missing? Um, common sense, I think, is a lot, is lacking a lot more so than it was back in the day. People. Like, people don't know when to get out of a bad relationship and when to stay in a good one. I feel like relationships today, in college relationships, especially like in a, in a uh, Greek life setting, they're, they're all based on like going to parties and having fun that way. But they're never going to see each other in the like real, real life, like see what they do during the day. Like in the 50s, they, they used to like take you out on dates and candle, like, I mean, I'm, I'm down for the candlelit uh, di dinners and long walks on the beach, but that's what, like, it's old fashioned, and I feel like that my, our parents had it right, but this is, like, all sped up now.